Amidst rising inflation, Americans are feeling the squeeze of higher prices on everything from gas to groceries. But when inflation bumps into the already rising cost of drugs such as insulin, the impact can be serious and the stakes are high. According to a new study, released earlier this month from charity Rx, 79% of you, S adults who have diabetes or care for someone who does say paying for insulin has created financial difficulty. Four out of five people surveyed reported having taken on credit card debt to cover those costs, with the average credit card debt reach $9.000. The survey revealed that many people with diabetes face potentially unpleasant or difficult trade-offs because of the cost of insulin. Of those surveyed who have struggled financially due to the cost of insulin, 83% said they were afraid of not being able to pay for living expenses as a result. About half said they've cut their spending on clothing, 55%, or food. 50% to be able to pay for insulin. Nearly one-third, 29%, said they've had to adjust rent or mortgage expenses. Another 63% said they've felt pressure to sell possessions and half said they've put themselves in risky situations to get money for insulin. About a third of respondents, 32%, said they've had to sell prescriptions or illicit drugs to get the money they need to pay for insulin. Perhaps even more concerning are the strategies survey respondents reported using to stretch out their insulin. For example, 62% of survey respondents reported skipping and or adjusting their insulin dosage to save money. Taking less than the recommended amount of insulin can have negative consequences. Of survey respondents who reported rationing their insulin, 54% reported that they couldn't do everyday activities, 44% said they couldn't work, and 37% said they couldn't go to school, 